I see this for a couple of weeks. At Pro Day, um, you were hanging out with Matt Rule for like half an hour. <laughs> what, what was that about? Did you already know him? And um, yeah, I kind of already knew him just from being recruited in high school, and just we were just catching up a little bit. You know, he said he's been watching me, so just staying on my on my grind. I know you switched a lot of positions and stuff. He was talking about you as a cornerback. That sort of validate the decision. Uh, yeah, um, playing corner, I, I feel like I've found my new home at corner, and um, just standing growing and growing at that position. And uh, he was looking at me at corner, so yeah, that just solidified it even more. Uh, 205 to 208 in that range. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Just taking that, that next step in, you said you found your country at home. How have you seen yourself grow? Um, just the fundamentals, you know, watching myself on film, I feel more comfortable and I think I look more comfortable at the position versus before it was just, it was still kind of new to me, but I feel like it's more natural to me now. Uh, you know, now I'm kind of, I've been here probably one of the longest out of the, out of the secondary, so it's just stepping into that leadership role and um, being more confident in myself and what I see on the field so I can make checks, make calls um, before, they, before it happens on the field. You know, initially I just I felt like it was just another opportunity just to show how versatile I can be as a football player and as an athlete. And then, I mean, when it comes down to it, I, I prefer corner now. But just showing that I can play both sides of the ball, because, I mean, it's not easy to be running routes forward and then have to do it backwards, like right after. So just showing I can do both. Is there a moment for you where you feel like it kind of clicked for you at corner? Uh, I can't put a like a specific moment on it but just this spring kind of the whole spring has just felt really well felt really good for me uh this spring it, it's probably mingo but you know he's um he hasn't been doing too much right now but i say mingo uh, i feel like we have a lot more um a lot of different things we can do with the defense now, a lot of disguises, a lot of different um, checks and stuff. Um, it's some of the same stuff, but overall, I think it's going to be a lot better. From just the couple of practices we've got in the same side, is it more aggressive? Is that something you'll notice? Yeah, we, we, more aggressive coming after the ball. Has that been different for you with the new position coach? Kind of how's, how's that been uh, it's, been a, it's been a good transition. You know, he, uh, coach Carter is a younger coach, um, and his, a lot of his coaching style is kind of tailored to to youth athletes, so it's, it's been a good change. This might be a dumb question, but with so many new faces every year in the secondary, we hear about chemistry. How long does it take to kind of build that chemistry? How long does it take to get to know a teammate when you have somebody like tennis center or right. machine or any of that? Um, I think we do a good job of uh, having, um, having events outside of football just to build, build uh, chemistry with each other. But during fourth quarter, you know, just grinding out with each other over in uh, over the over those workouts and everything. I think that just builds and then seven on seven and stuff together after we work out just building chemistry with each other, knowing what our strengths and weaknesses are. Who organizes those events? Is it coaches? Is it players? How do you guys uh, the events, sometimes it's the coaches, sometimes we just all call each other and say we're all gonna go bowling or something like that and we all just meet up and have fun. Who's the best bowler? Me. <laughs> <laughs> Check the season if you want to you know if you want. Um, so actually, I was in the portal my fresh or er, sophomore year, but that was before Coach Kiffin got here. And when that staff got here, I kind of felt like they knew what what they were doing and that it was a pro mindset kind of um, environment, and I just wanted to be around that.